Sailors aboard the USS Harry S. Truman will have to wait a little longer to be reunited with their families. As the U.S. ramps up its fight against ISIS, the Navy has extended the Stripe Group's deployment. Ten on your side's Joe Fisher joins us now with how the news has emotions running high here at home. Joe? Brandy, the USS Truman was slated to return home to Norfolk in June. The Navy announced Friday, though, that the deployment has been extended by 30 days as the sailors continue their work to weed out terrorist networks in the Middle East. 10 on your side was pier side in November as the USS Harry S. Truman Carrier Strike Group deployed from Naval Station Norfolk bound for the Middle East. A seven month deployment now extended to eight months. There's no hint. Sometimes you can speak in code to kind of like let spouses know what's going on. Um, there's no hint of anything. Shannon Steidel is the wife of Lieutenant Casey Steidel. She and her two children, ages 11 and 14, have been anxiously awaiting his return and the safe return of 5,000 other sailors. It's just hard. Like, I don't have any family here. We're not from around here. Um, my best friend just moved to Florida. So I don't really have a whole lot of support. Like, he is my support system. As a Navy veteran who has been deployed two times herself, Steidel says she's always prepared for change. You can't really be shocked by it too much. I mean, obviously, they're doing an awesome job out there, and that's why they're staying out there. So. In April, the strike group set a record for the most bombs used during Operation Inherent Resolve. That's a mission by the U.S. to destroy ISIS and the remnants of Al-Qaeda. Steidel says the extension is not only tough on loved ones, but the sailors, too. They were ready to come back. Um, they're looking forward to it, but like I said, they, they're out there. They know they have a job to do. And the very day the Navy announced the extension, Steidel's husband got promoted to lieutenant. A reminder that while being separated is a challenge, her husband continues to make her very proud. There's really not a whole lot you can do besides just support them. Mm -hmm. And she says she will give her husband that support. The USS Harry S. Truman Carrier is supported by the cruiser USS Anzio and destroyers USS Bulkley, USS Gonzales, and USS Gravely. The, the Navy announced in 2014 to shorten the deployment of carriers to seven months to help alleviate the burden on families. So far, those shorter deployments have not gone as planned. I'm Joe Fisher, 10 on your side.